student attendance system in crowded classrooms using a smartphone camera by Mary McKinney and Villalobos from the Catholic University of Chile. This is my classroom with around 70 students. If we want to manage an attendance sheet, we have two different solutions. The first one is the manual attendance sheet. For this case, it takes more than four minutes. The second one is the automated attendance system. That is what we are proposing in our work. We take an image and using a computer vision algorithm, we are able to build an attendance sheet automatically. Let me show you our proposed method. We have a list of enrolled students. That means we ask for a selfie for every student and we make here a face detection and a description in order to build an enrollment database. The goal of our algorithm is to determine if a specific student is present or not in each session. Of course, we repeat this procedure for every student of the list. Let me show you an example. These are the session images of the classroom. In this example, we have four different images. For all of them, we detect the faces. And for every detected face, we extract the features. Now, if we want to know if, for example, a student 57 is present, we take the image of the enrollment database. We extract the descriptor and we compare with the database of the session. How does the matching work? We compare the descriptor of the enrollment with all descriptors of the session. If we find two descriptors that are similar enough, we can say that this person, 57, is present. Let me show you an example with a demo. We have 25 days. That means the semester has 25 days and we have here an example, we are looking for John Smith, if he was present or not in 25 sessions. The report here is he was present in 20 sessions, he was not present in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so the attendance percentage is 80%. Let me show you where he was on June 7th. We can see that John Smith was on the last. Well, another example, in this case, on March 22, he was here. Okay, let me come back to our presentation. These are the results that we have. We evaluated 10 different descriptors, and the accuracy is around 95% with FaceNet. If we want to increase the accuracy, we can include in the enrollment database the face images of the first, for example, three sessions. So FaceNet is assuming around 97%. And we can increase that using more sessions. If we want to know how is the behavior using more images in the sessions, these are the graphics. Let me show you right now the conclusions. Here are our contributions. A full annotated data set of images of a classroom with around 70 students in 25 sessions taken by a smartphone camera during 15 weeks. A Python implementation available on GitHub. And a comparison of 10 different face recognition methods in this takes with more than 95%. So thank you very much and I invite you to our poster.